The importance of the importance of a mother is immense. A mother is that noble person who carried her child in her womb for nine months, nurtured them, and protected them from all kinds of pain. وقضى ربك ألا تعبدوا إلا إياه وبالوالدين إحسانا. The Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم also emphasized the importance of mother in hadith. Assalamu alaikum and a very good morning to all of you. How are you all doing today? That's really wonderful. My respected teachers and my beloved friends or honorable audience, I would like to speak about the importance of mother in islam the importance of the importance of a mother is immense quran and hadith repeatedly emphasize her status and respect a mother is that noble person who carried her child in her womb for nine months nurtured them and protected them from all kinds of pain and suffering after their after their birth my beloved friends as you know allah has commanded us in the quran to be kind to be kind to our parents good treatment especially to our mothers allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says surah al isra verse number 23 a'ud billahi minash shaitanir rajim bismillahir rahmanir rahim wa qada rabbuka alla ta'budu illa iyyah وبالوالدين إحسانا إما يبلغن عندك الكبر أحدهما أو كلاهما فلا تقل لهما أف ولا تنهرهما وقل لهما قولا كريما. And your Lord has decreed that you not worship except Him and to parent and to parents good treatment whether one or both of them reach all days while with you and and so not so not, so not so not to them so much as oof and do not repel them but to speak them a noble word my beloved friends as you know allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says the prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam also emphasized the importance of mother in hadith he said جاء رجل إلى رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم فقال يا رسول الله من أحق الناس بحسن صحابتي فقال أمك ثم من قال ثم أمك قال ثم من قال ثم أمك قال ثم من قال ثم أبوك أن a man came to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, peace be upon him, and said, "Who among the people is the most deserving of my good companionship?" The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Your mother." The man said, "Then who?" The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Your mother." The man asked again. The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Your mother." The man then asked, the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, your father. And another occasion, the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, al-jannatu tahta aqdam al-ummahat. My beloved friends, this hadith indicate that a mother's this hadith indicates that a mother's rank is higher than that of a father. From this, we learn that we must treat our mothers is a long life duty that never ends, regardless of their age. My beloved friends, finally it is important that to finally it is important to remember that the peace and spiritual joy find in Serving one's mother cannot be found in any other act. May Allah give us the strength to serve our mothers, and and their and through their prayers grant us success. Say Amin. I conclude my speech.
thanking you all for listening to me patiently and hardly. Thank you so much and have a fantastic day.